Energizing your soul through the inspired Word of God. This is your daily devotional reading. This Day with God, a devotional by Ellen White. February 17th. Take time to be holy. Take time to be holy, the world rushes on. Spend much time in secret with Jesus alone. Make friends of God's children, help those who are weak, forgetting in nothing his blessings to seek. Take time to be holy. For whatsoever things were written aforetime were written for our learning that we through patience and comfort of the scriptures might have hope. Romans chapter 15 verse 4. We say to every soul, study your Bible as you have never studied it before. Let the affirmative of truth come forth from human lips under the dictation of the Holy Spirit. I beg of all to watch and pray, lest they enter into temptation. The work going on in the world means much to us all. It is now as it was when the message was given in Noah's day, and the invitation went forth for all who would to enter the ark. We know not how soon the last message of warning may be given, and our case is fixed for eternity. But the Lord is gracious, and he presents the invitation, Come, for all things are now ready. Luke chapter 14, verse 17. There was hope for all the inhabitants of the Noahic world to enter the ark before the door was closed. After it was closed, those who entered were severely tried, for they were in the ark a full week before the rain came. Oh, what fearful scoffing and mocking and defiance of God there was by those who had refused to enter. But after the week was ended, the rain began to fall gently. This was a new thing. The rain continued until every living thing was destroyed from the face of the earth. But one family, the family that entered the ark, was saved. We need now to be prepared for the closing scenes of this earth's history. Let all search their own hearts diligently and be converted, that their sins may be pardoned. The world is becoming more and more decidedly opposed to God and to the truth of God. All who will do the will of God will be successful in obtaining knowledge and their experience will be valuable. We must now prepare to do a great work in a short time. We must have an individual experience. And if we will come to the Lord in humility, he will be found of us and he will work with us and his salvation will be revealed. Day and night, I've been sending my prayers up to the Lord. I've been weighed down as I have thought of the situation of those who have had such great light and yet have gone steadily on, step by step in rejection of light. I long to see the unbelief break. I long to see Satan defeated and expelled. I am holding on by the gift of faith. This Day with God, February 17th. I encourage you to be ye doers of the word and not hearers only. Thank you for listening and be sure to join us tomorrow for your daily devotional reading.